Hey guys, Zach here. Um, now, I've been doing some thinking, and I thought to myself, you know, I already do Jurassic Park figure reviews, and I already do Godzilla figure reviews, so, to me, it just makes sense to just not do Sonic figure reviews anymore, and Transformers figure reviews anymore. Don't get me wrong, I'm still gonna make Sonic and Transformers videos, you know? Like, if there's a new Transformers movie, or a new Sonic game, or it doesn't even have to be, like, necessarily new. It could be something old, like uh, Sonic 3 and Knuckles, or Sonic Adventure, or the 1986 Transformers movie. Bottom line, I'll review it, you know? Just, they're not going to be as frequent as my Jurassic Park or my Godzilla figure reviews. So, yeah. Bottom line, I'm not going to be reviewing Transformers or Sonic figure reviews, or I'm not going to be reviewing... Sonic figures or Transformers figures anymore, but I will still uh, make videos related to these two uh, properties, so yeah. Anyway, before I uh, stop entirely, I just want to do a little brief review of these two figures right here, like before I stop entirely, so yeah. So let's get on with that. So first we'll take a look at the Masterpiece Grimlock. Now when I saw this figure back in early 2015, like, I think it was either February, January, it might, even, it might have even have been like, you know, like 2014, like December or something like that. But, yeah, ever since then, you know, I've been, uh, you know, wanting this figure, you know. I said to myself, the first time I saw this figure, I said to myself, holy shit, this figure looks awesome, I'm definitely going to go get it. So, you know, I finally get it two years later. And I was expecting too much, you know. The T-Rex mode is good. I like the T-Rex mode a lot. It's just that the robot mode is a little unstable, basically. A lot of uh, joints on mine are very loose. And it's kind of hard to, like, transform this. Or, not hard. It's just a pain in the ass to transform this figure. So, yeah. Bottom line, this figure is definitely great, you know. It's not perfect, but it's definitely great, you know. My favorite, tra this is my favorite Transformers figure that I own. And, yeah. If you want to know how much this figure is, it's about, like, $122. To me, that's a little bit overpriced. That's probably because it came out in 2009. But, either way, this figure is still a little bit overpriced. And if you can get this figure for a cheaper price, definitely do it. So, yeah. Anyway. That is the Masterpiece Grimlock. Now we'll take a look at the Toy Island Sonic. Now, say what you want about this thing. It's a piece of shit. It looks like trash. If something like this was made today, the company would go out of business. I love this thing, alright? I personally love this thing, you know? It is impossible for me to talk shit about this thing, because I absolutely love this thing. For two reasons. One... This thing is classic. The reason why, like, this thing came out in 1998, you know, and that's kind of why it looks shitty now, or that's kind of why it looks shitty now, but, yeah, this thing, you know, it's a classic, all right? This figure's a classic, and it's really hard to hate on this figure. That, and I get a lot of uh, sentimental feelings when it comes to this figure, because uh, a really good friend of mine, uh, when we were in fifth grade, he invited me over to his birthday, and he gave me this figure, you know, and I said, holy shit, thanks, dude, this means a lot to me. So, yeah, ever since then, this figure has gained a special place in my heart, you know. I did say, like, not on camera, but I did say in the past at one point to uh, a couple of my friends, you know, I might sell, like, I might sell some of my Sonic figures, you know, but I know for a fact I'm never going to sell this figure because, you know, this figure holds a special place in my heart. So, yeah. So, yeah, I love this thing, you might not, and that's cool. All I'm saying is that I love this thing. But, anyway, yeah. If you want to know how big these figures are, here they both are next to Dr. Billy Grant. Alright. Now, anyway, that is basically it. You know, that's, uh, that's it. This is my uh, last Transformers slash Sonic video on my channel, you know. Thank you to all of the Sonic fans and Jurassic Park, or not Jurassic Park, my... Thank you to all the Sonic fans and Transformers fans who subscribe to my channel. You know, it means a lot to me. Like, you know what? 
like, I'm just going to say this right now. I'm going to go a little bit off topic here. But I just want to thank you guys so much for 60 subscribers. This doesn't just go to the Sonic and Transformers fans. Like, everyone who subscribed to my channel. Thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. It means so much to me that you subscribe to my channel, you know? Because, I'm going to be honest, my videos aren't perfect, you know? All I do is I sit in front of a camera with a couple of action figures and I talk about them, you know? I don't edit anything, you know? I just leave it raw, you know? So, yeah, I just record and upload, you know? My videos aren't perfect, you know? And other YouTubers, you know, like uh, Toxic Sidearms, you know? Like, he, like, he puts that effort into his videos, you know? He plays video games, you know, like, he, like, gets, like, you know, he records it, like, off his PS4, you know, he just, he doesn't stick a camera in front of his TV and play them. That's something I would do, you know, but he puts in more effort than I do when it comes to his videos, you know? That, and he actually edits his videos, so, yeah. I'm gonna, uh, you know, link his channel in the description below, you know, but, yeah, bottom line... Thank you guys so much for subscribing to my channel. It means a lot to me, you know. My videos aren't the best, you know. I can openly say that right now, but it still means a lot to me that, you know, I have 60 people watching my content, so, yeah. Anyway, that is it for today. Have a great rest of your week, and I will see you in the next video. Peace, Zach out.